namaste ta kwenyo iti enini bia ibo eh mulembe makwa I just realized I've not been greeting in Luganda. My son is in Uganda. How could I forget? Anyhow, if you realize that in all my greetings, your language does not appear, just let me know in the comments how you do it in your language, and I'll definitely add it in my list because travel is for everyone, yeah? So, did I say Daibo? Did I say Kopongo? I hope so. I want to believe I did. Eh, we kaza. Hey. Very good. So, my name is Jackie Devoy, and I am so happy to be back in yet another episode of Travel with Enoch and Jackie. We're back at the Taj Asian Bistro right here at the Garden City rooftop. And I hope that you and I, together, we can make tourism travel more sustainable. My husband and I are so passionate about SDG 15. So, Travel with Enoch and Jackie has been ongoing for the last six years. So, I think you've heard about bungee jumping. I actually believe you've heard about it. But have you experienced it? Or you have your reservations? Or you got your fears? Or you're still thinking about it? If you've experienced it, what was the experience? If you haven't, what are your fears? Don't worry. In this episode of Travel with Enoch and Jackie, we're going to go to Kangulu Mira and go bungee jumping with Adrift. We'll also bring you the do's and don'ts and everything you need to know if you ever want to go bungee jumping or about why you should go bungee jumping. And for the business owners, hotel business owners and managers, you also not forgotten, Enoch has you covered. When we return, uh, he'll be joining us in the marketing hacks and then he'll give you tips on how to boost your hotel online sales and improve your online business. I mean presence as a hotel or accommodation owner. So don't you miss a thing. It's an action-packed show. But first, let's go to Kangulumira. Let's go bungee jumping. Adrift bungee jumping, an exhilarating experience in Uganda. Uganda is home to some of the most spectacular bungee jumping sites in the world and a drift bungee jumping is by far the most experienced and accredited operator on the continent. ISO certified equipment and regulated audits for all crew and maintenance routines ensure that your experience is both safe and exhilarating. The purpose-built bungee jump is constructed and operated to the highest U.S. and Canadian standards, so you can be sure you're in good hands. Why not take this opportunity to leap over the source of the Nile and experience one of the most exhilarating bungee jumps in the world? is bungee jumping. Bungee jumping is an activity that involves jumping from a high place while connected to a large elastic cord. The cord is attached to a harness that is fitted around the jumper's ankles and the other end is secured to the jumping platform. Bungee jumping was originally developed as a rite of passage ceremony by the young men of various tribes in Vanatu, an island nation in the South Pacific Ocean. Nowadays, it is practiced all over the world as a recreational activity. It is important to note that bungee jumping is not without risk and should only be undertaken after receiving proper instruction and training. Why is Uganda a great place to bungee jump? Uganda is a great place to bungee jump for a number of reasons. First, the scenery is unbeatable. The country is home to some of the most beautiful landscapes in Africa and the jump site is no exception. Second, the experience is unlike any other. Adrift Bungee Jumping Uganda is one of the only companies in the world that offers bungee jumping over the source of the Nile. And lastly, but not least, the staff is professional and safety is always a priority. If you are looking for an adrenaline pumping adventure, bungee jumping in Uganda is a must. What 
what are the benefits of bungee jumping? Bungee jumping is an adrenaline pumping activity that is perfect for those who are looking for a thrill. While it may not be for everyone, those who do enjoy bungee jumping often find that it is a great way to get outside and experience something new. Bungee jumping can also be a great way to challenge yourself. If you are someone who is looking for a way to push your boundaries, bungee jumping may be the perfect activity for you. It can also be a great way to overcome your fears. If you are considering bungee jumping, there are a few things you need to know. First, it is important to find a reputable company to jump with. There are many bungee jumping companies out there, but not all of them are created equal. Adrift Bungee Jumping is one of the most reputable companies in the business, and they are best in Uganda. When you are searching for a company to jump with, be sure to read reviews and do your research. Once you have found a company you can trust, you will be good to go. to bungee jump safely. Bungee jumping is an extreme sport that is not for everyone. It requires a certain amount of courage and physical fitness. If you are thinking of bungee jumping, it is important to make sure that you are doing it safely. Adrift Bungee Jumping Uganda is a company that is dedicated to providing safe bungee jumping experiences. They have a team of professionals who are experienced in safety and have all the necessary equipment. Tips for the first time bungee jumpers. Are you looking for an adrenaline pumping activity to add to your bucket list? If so, bungee jumping may be the perfect activity for you. Bungee jumping is an exhilarating experience that can be enjoyed by people of all ages. If you have never bungee jumped before, here are a few things you should know before taking the plunge. First, you will need to make sure that you are physically fit enough to participate in this activity. Bungee jumping is not recommended for pregnant women, people with heart conditions, or those who are under the influence of drugs or alcohol. You will also need to wear proper safety equipment. This includes a bungee cord, harness and a safety briefing will be provided by the staff at the bungee jumping facility and you should make sure that you understand all the safety procedures before participating. Once you've taken all of these precautions, you are ready to experience the thrill of a lifetime. In conclusion, that is our Adrift bungee story and experience. Now, let's hear from the professional who manages this activity. My name is Peter Moves, and I'm the operations manager for Adrift Uganda and the Mara World Waters. So, today we are going to talk about this bungee or drift. Adrift bungee is the newest and, and tallest bungee tower in East Africa. It is 52 meters and uh, it is the safest tower we have in Uganda now. Uh, this tower here you can see in the background uh, is uh, a very very safe tower which was uh, constructed from steel imported from the UAE. Uh, with the bungee tower here we have a bungee cord which is elastic imported also from Taiwan. It is very very safe that uh, there are no issues that can happen on that tower. Uh, with people interested in bungee jumping, we have weight limits, but no age limits. So we expect somebody between 35 kilograms and 110 kilograms to jump off that tower. Uh, whoever is interested in jumping must be medically fit, i.e. has no previous dislocations, is uh, not uh, having high blood pressure, and uh, is generally a, a, normal, a normal person without any health issues. People who are pregnant and uh, have uh, medical conditions are not allowed to jump from that tower. So this bungee tower is operated by the Canadian Bungee Association, which is the most legit professional association for bungee towers in the world. So it was just opened recently on 16th September 2022 
and I welcome all Ugandans to come and bang jump. We have special rest for Ugandans, so you are invited to bang jump with us. on Magic One Television. My name is Jackie DeWay and you're watching Travel with Enoch and Jackie. Now, I told you, I said over and over, this show is about SDG 15, but we are really dedicated to the long-term survival of tourism. How do we do that? We do it together. If you win as a travel business owner or manager, then the industry is thriving. And of course, we welcome Enoch Aldris and Suboga to share his expertise as a digital marketer on how you as a hotel manager or owner can improve your hotel online presence or sales. And today he's talking about email marketing. us on the show if you're just joining us welcome better let than never if you started the show with us thank you so much for sticking around my name is Jackie Dewey and in a bit you know Audrey Sintoboga gets to bring his A game as a marketer and today he's talking email marketing but first get to meet each other you are meeting you know, me. <laughs> <laughs> hi Jackie hi you know how are you Hi viewer, uh -huh. my name is Enoch Nsubuga mm -hmm. and I'm a digital marketer. Mm -hmm. I help hotels mm -hmm. and uh, travel brands grow their online presence and sales. And so today uh, we're going to be talking about email marketing for hotels. And before you get into email marketing for hotels, Enoch is, has got, uh, is powered by Hotel Online and this segment, but exactly it's Hotel Online in less than a minute and then we get to understand what email marketing is. Yeah, so Jackie and uh, our dear viewer, uh, Hotel Online is uh, a hotel software mm. that has been helping uh, hotels grow their online sales and revenues, mm -hmm. plus streamlining their front desk operations since 20, since 2014. Okay, yeah. so today we're talking email marketing for hotels. Yes. Very hotel, small, medium, or big. This is for you. What exactly is email marketing? Jackie and our dear viewer, email marketing is um, using email communication to reach your target audience. This could be your past guests or someone planning to make a trip to your destination or property. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so email marketing is uh, one of the most powerful tools uh, for marketing and uh, when used well, when used uh, effectively, it could return, uh, it could have very high return on investment. Okay. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> I don't even know where to start. Yeah. That's what I need to know about email marketing. Yes. So what are the benefits there? Yeah, so Jackie, uh, for the benefits, I would like to share a few benefits for email marketing. Mm -hmm. And uh, starting with um, email marketing, if used correctly, it's going to help you increase your brand awareness and recognition. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it will also help, uh, help you promote special offers and discounts. Uh, email marketing will also help you drive uh, website traffic. Okay. Email marketing will help you generate direct bookings. Uh, email marketing will also help you boost your customer loyalty. So uh, what happens with email marketing? You're sending out uh, your marketing message on oh. email. Oh, yeah? okay. So uh, in this message, it, it could be about your special offers, it could be about the activities around your property. It could be about uh, an upgrade uh, of your property. So basically, it's an opportunity yeah, for you to keep in touch with this guest that stayed at your hotel and that guest that is planning to come. To come. Okay, so how yeah. do I collect these emails? Maybe I'm a new hotel and I don't even have people that have made a booking yet. Very nice question. Mm -hmm. yeah. So um, I'm happy to uh, uh, announce that uh, Hotel Online 
as a solution, uh, the, uh, the channel manager will help you, first of all, um, during the booking process, it will help you capture that email for that guest that okay. is booking into your hotel. Okay. And uh, once that email is captured, then it can help you, uh, it can help you create campaigns, yeah? Uh, one of those campaigns could be, you know, trying to get feedback from your guests, yeah? Okay. Or, or what people call reviews, yeah? Uh, it, 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 it will send out questions uh, to your guests, asking them on, uh, to share their experience and, you know, how they found the property and stuff like that. So, it will help you with reviews. Mm. Yeah. So, so I even get reviews and exactly, all that stuff exactly. that I need to look serious. Exactly. Okay, so what is the bonus for today? Yeah, uh, one bonus, it might be not connected to uh, email marketing. Yeah, but important for the hotel business. But I would like to advise every hotel owner or accommodation provider okay. to invest into a blog on your website. You see, with a blog, it's, it's going to help you with content marketing. Content marketing simply means you write information that uh, your target audience is looking for. So I'm Googling about, say, Asian foods in Uganda, then I'm able to find the Taj Asian Bistro and the story about them. Exactly. Oh, so okay. if you're a restaurant like uh, Taj yeah. uh, Asian Bistro, make sure that you have a blog and start writing about, uh, for instance, food. Yeah? Okay. Make sure that every question that anyone is going to search uh, oh, about food, food Asian, especially Asian Indian, food. Indian, Chinese, Singapore meals. Exactly, you, you exactly you've written an article about that. Oh, yeah. That means that whenever anyone searches Indian food or um, Asian this, Asian that, mm -hmm. anything about food, Make sure yeah, that it's, it's you shows up in okay. Google. Oh. And so that's, that's what uh, blogging, blogging does or, you know, or using um, uh, articles to market your business. Thank you so much. I really love the bonus and I love the email marketing and I love that even if I am brand new, I can actually start right away. The Bible says we perish for lack of knowledge. knowledge. And now here we're getting the free knowledge. Thank you so much. Yep. Yeah. <laughs>
360. Everybody should benefit from this travel show because we are about sustainable tourism. Let's support SDG 15 and keep travel alive. It was beautiful to chill with you. My name is Jackie Dewey. Until next time, Enoch and I can't wait to return to your screen.